In this video, we are going to cover the deployment and recovery of Checkpoint Full Disk Encryption from the Sandblast Agent Management Platform. Start by logging into the Infinity Portal and make sure you are in the Sandblast Agent Management Platform. Navigate to the Policy section and select Data Protection. Ensure Full Disk Encryption has Checkpoint Encryption selected. In this example, we are only deploying full disk encryption. If you already have other software blades deployed, you just need to add full disk encryption to your policy. Save and install policy. If you already have Sandblast Agent deployed, the full disk encryption will start to deploy to your systems. If this is a new deployment, navigate to the Overview section and download the initial agent. Once you have downloaded the MSI file, right-click it and install it on the system where you want to deploy Sandblast Agent. Once the initial agent connects to the management server and downloads the deployment package, it will prompt you to install. Click on Install Now. Once the installation is complete, you will need to reboot the system. Once the reboot is complete, Sandblast Agent Full Disk Encryption will get the policy from the management server, upload the recovery key, and assign the logged in user a pre-boot account with their logged in credentials. The system will need a reboot to enable the full disk encryption. Upon reboot, the user will be presented with the pre-boot login. The user logs in with their Active Directory username and password. Once the user logs back into Windows, the drives will start to encrypt. To recover a system that has been encrypted with Checkpoint Full Disk Encryption, log into the Infinity Portal, navigate to Computer Management. Click on Recovery and click Full Disk Encryption Recovery. You can search for the system name or locate it in the drop-down menu. Recovery Media requires two pre-boot accounts assigned to the system. If there is only one listed, you can add an additional one now. Click on Download Recovery File and save it to your system. Once you have downloaded the recovery file, open File Explorer and go to C, Program Files x86, Checkpoint, Endpoint Security, Full Disk Encryption. Right-click on Use Rec and run as administrator. Select the recovery file you downloaded from the Infinity Portal. You have two options for creating recovery media. You can create an ISO to burn to a CD, or you can create a bootable USB drive. Enter one of the pre-boot users allowed to recover the drive. Boot to one of the recovery media options.
enter one of the pre-boot users allowed to recover the drive again to start the recovery process. Select the partitions to be recovered or select Recover All. Once selected, the partitions or the drive will start the decryption process. When the drive is fully decrypted, the full disk encryption status will be in an initializing status. You should uninstall the full disk encryption blade from the management server for this system or uninstall the agent from the system.